Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be going over the best two graphics cards you can currently buy for the money. These are priced at between $250 and a little bit over $300, and I think for your money, these are the best graphics cards you can get right now on Amazon, so let's go ahead and get started. As you can see on the screen, we're currently looking at the RTX 4060 by NVIDIA. I think this is the number one best for your money, right around the $300 range, uh, cheap graphics card you can get. You're gonna get really good performance with gaming and other tasks, and it really doesn't break the bank. As you can see here, you can actually find some for less than $300, which is really, really good. I'll leave a link below to a few of my favorite listings for each of these cards. But as I scroll through the 4060s, you can tell that there's several options here. Um, and like I said, I'll link to a few of my favorites so you it can help you uh, choose which ones um, I think are the best because there's definitely some on Amazon that are from like third party vendors. You don't really want that. You want to ideally get it um, either through a trusted vendor or uh, I usually like to look for listings that are directly from Amazon or the, the manufacturer. Now, if you're not interested in getting a NVIDIA graphics card and you really want an AMD graphics card for some reason, whatever that might be, uh, the, the next best and comparable uh, same price range um, for the most part. GPU is going to be the RX 7600 by AMD. As you can tell, they actually typically start even lower price, which is good if you're really on that budget and want to cut down another $50 on your build or whatever uh, you know money you have saved up. Um, so you can actually get these most of these starting right at around $250 price range. But if you do want to get an overclocked one or a certain brand, um, they can go up to 280 or very close to that 300 mark, as you can tell. And again, I'll link to these in the description below to some of my favorite listings here that I think are the best deals um, from a trusted source as well. But this is the AMD version if you are wanting you know, an AMD card instead of an NVIDIA card for whatever reason. If we compare both of these cards on the user benchmark, you can tell that they're pretty similar overall. I mean, there's really not too much difference, very minimal difference, so they're pretty equal. I think either one you decide to go with, um, you're going to be happy with. But as you can tell, the NVIDIA card has insanely higher market share and is hugely more popular. I think that's just due to the uh, general assumption that NVIDIA is better and also it's gen as it says here, it's just more popular among people. Um, and like I said, that's what I would go with. I personally think it's uh, the best overall. But again, the RX 7600 is still very, very good for the price. And like I said earlier, and we looked at the listings, you can actually get it for even $50 cheaper than the 4060 and get it right around that $250 uh, price range, which makes it very affordable for the performance. Now, um, just to kind of uh, prove that the 4060 might even be better than the 7600. Um, I notice if we take a look at the real world speed here on user benchmark, um, which has a performance profile from about 50,000 user samples, it would appear that the Nvidia cards tests on the benchmarks are all more closer grouped, which is very good. They're all up towards the high end um, of this range. Whereas if you take a look at the RX 7600, it looks like there's people that have uh, more varying performance issues or just varying performance in general with the RX 7600. And this might be because some of these lower end ones that are down here in the orange and even the red uh, might be like the $250 versions. And maybe these higher ones are just the 300 and some dollar uh, versions that might be overclocked or things like that. So I don't think it's too concerning or a deal breaker, but it does go to show you that the RTX 4060 from NVIDIA does seem to have a more consistent, um, good performance. Hopefully this helped you find the right budget GPU for your build. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed. And as always, See you next time.